need to keep going. Even after spending a lot of time here, this world is still so strange. Really? What is this place? <laughs> Ray! You came to see me. No, I came for my sister. It matters not. So long as you provide work for us as the contract stipulates. A job change from home security to purgatory security. <laughs> Just tell me what I need to do already. I ponder if you even possess the determination. A contract with a demon is no easy task. I will do anything for Mariah. <gasps> anything? <laughs> this is gonna be fun. There are two things we require you to accomplish. The first, as I told you before, gather seven crystals known as Idia. You shall find out how in due time. For now, we shall let you keep the Idia, including this one. Revival will cost you all that you find. Your other job is the ordeal of being our executor, cleaning this world. Like, squeaky clean. What do you mean? <laughs> Squashing all those things you call monsters. Specters and revenants. You can use your sword to crush them all. The big ones and the tiny ones. Specters and revenants disrupt the structure of our realm. We ask you slay them to restore order. Just to be nice, I'll choose areas where Mariah's soul is wandering. Okay, it's not like I have a choice anyway. I will fight anything in order to hold Mariah's hand again. Very well. It appears you are able to harness your blessing. It's okay, Ray. We'll teach you everything you need to know. At least for now. a strong idea. I am. Huh? There's a person coming out of that butterfly. <laughs> when someone has a strong will, their true form may be revealed. True form? Anyway, let's return to introducing ourselves. I am just a boring peddler. If you need something, you can trade your essence for it. What would you like? See you again soon!
on your head I'm fine can you tell me something what are specters and revenants why do I fight them they are nothing to worry over mere monsters is not your sister's revival reason enough to combat them
of them <laughs> you should be careful you see that ring over its head that's not a specter it's a revenant specters revenants can someone just tell me what they are it is more interesting if you do not know please continue mindlessly vanquishing them
What was that? The specter's voice? No, it's... emotions? It felt like pain, sadness, and regret. It used words as if... That means... they're not monsters. It was human. A human just like me. <laughs> it's born. A shiny idiot. <laughs> what does this mean? Twas wise of us to appoint you as executor. You called them monsters, didn't you? You said they were nothing but monsters! Why do you care? Is it truly shocking that these monsters were once human? I heard a voice. It came from inside me. You must have come in contact with the soul when you vanquished it. Let it not bother you. They are merely former humans. They are long deceased. Mere corpses. <sighs> This realm is named Purgatory, a name coined by us. This world was forged for the reincarnation of souls. By using souls and the cogs of renewal, it wipes everything, like personality and memory. In other words, this is the afterlife. Afterlife? I can't believe it, but if Mariah is dead and her soul still exists, that means I was killing humans with my very own hands. The emotions of the dead are still there, still inside me. It hurts. Then you should weep. <laughs> Cry! And let them leave your body along with the tears. It'll make things easier. In purgatory, when a self-conscious being emotionally secretes bodily fluids, the fluids form a unique crystal. Idia. So you're telling me to keep crying? You want me to keep doing this horrible thing? If you wish for your sister to reach revival, You'll be fine, Ray. Keep carving up those specters and revenants. And suffer so much more, and regret it, and cry! <laughs> Very well. That is all for today. Tis not about what you desire. You must fulfill our ordeal. That is what the contract stipulates. A contract with demons! Deal. Moreover, I need to tell you something. I don't want to hear it. Be not so cruel. 
Purgatory is a spiritual realm. An executor's strength relies on their mental fortitude. Your feelings forge the weapons and armor in Purgatory. Conquer the sadness and conflict within. Then your feelings, nay, your sentiments, shall be your strength. stronger through the pain and sorrow. A book will ease my mind. What should I wear? I won't run! I need to work harder. Ray, you seem motivated. Do I really need to do this? Do you really need to break the souls of the dead? Yes, you do, Ray. 
Unlike the just souls who become butterflies, these broke the rules of purgatory by refusing to lose their memories. And then they attack the just souls, disturbing the peace of purgatory, hence why they ought to be vanquished. Besides, it was part of the Revival's contract. Just or unjust, it ought not matter to you. Will this really save Mariah? Yes, of course. Revival is absolutely possible, and not only for Mariah. Okay, I will believe your words, for now. <laughs> Ray's gonna believe us. She said she's gonna believe us. <laughs> I, I take it back. Do not regard this one's nonsense. We may be demons, but tis still a contract. It shan't be misinterpreted. I hope so. Here I go. Um, are you a revenant too? You're collecting essence, fragments of souls. Who cares? It's not something you need to worry about. It won't affect your story whatsoever. I won't cause you trouble. As for those self-proclaimed demons, I already have both of their permission. I'm just a boring old peddler. What would you like? Back off! Huh. 
approach. Just... I'm sorry! My power is growing! Or again. No, I don't want to die. I, I, I don't want to die yet. It's dark. It hurts. It's cold. Don't lose sight. Remember who you are. What you wish. A voice? I'm resonating inside. It's warm. Remember, I... No, I... I'm... I'm Rei Hatata. Not anyone else. Mirai, my sister. I'm getting her back. I'm going to hold her hand again. That's why I'm here. There's no time to be stumbling around. You got your idea back, Ray. Would you like my help? Help? I don't know who you are, but please. Whatever it takes to bring back Mirai, I won't quit. No matter what. Then, my master, Ray Hatada, take this sword. It is your protector, Heraclitus itself. I am your guardian, Heraclitus. My guardian? And why? Why didn't you save Mirai back then? I reflect my master's own heart. Are you saying I wanted it? No. But when you look into the mirror while your heart is agitated, it reflects your inner self. Because I wasn't my usual self? Because I couldn't control myself? Precisely. Then Heraclitus, this time, can you lend your strength to Mirai? I cannot. I am your guardian. I cannot protect anyone but you. Damn it! Fine. You're so stubborn. Denying my ideals means you are denying yourself. Please, just be quiet. Understood.
underwater. Water. Yeah. 
one. I can't take it anymore. Master, don't let your guard down. What do you mean? Help me. What? It hurts. It hurts. Help me. What? Why is it talking? After all that pain, I'm still suffering. Huh? No, don't come. Master, give me your command. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to. If you are sorry, give me your soul! 
Master! Go! Diogenes! Huh. That was easy. If there's a guardian, does that mean you're also an executor? Aren't you kind of weak? Um... Thank you? Hold on. You're a cute girl. <laughs> Sorry I was too harsh earlier. Cuteness is justice. That alone is strength enough. Oh, don't hug me! I can't breathe! Oh, sorry. You are totally my type. Heraclitus? Cutter. Wait, hold on! Let me introduce myself. My name's Kokoro Fudoji. I'm 21 years old. Hope that ain't too old for ya. I'm Rei Hatata. I'm 15. Do you need to know my age? Rei, huh? Nice to meet ya. Ms. Fadoji, thank you for saving me earlier. You can call me Kokoro. Or better yet, Big Sis Kokoro. I'll just call you Kokoro. Can I ask you something? Are you an executor, too? Yep. I have a contract with those creepy twins, Mephis and Felice. So that would make you my senior. Are there more people like us? I don't think so. I've been an executor for a few months. You're the first one I've met. I see. Is that your guardian beside you? Sure is. Guardian Diogenes. It's a bit rough around the edges, but... Anyhow, I'd like to chat more, but I gotta go. Hope to see you again. Oh yeah, I want to ask. Have you heard of the name Anamnesis? I have. She's the one who attacked me. Where? Close by? Are you telling me she was all the way up here? Up here? I don't know about that. It was similar to here. Thank you. I'm gonna go look now. What are you going to do when you find Anamnesis? Huh? Well, you know. Get revenge. told me right away. <sighs> Guess there's no such thing as confidential information. Anyway, do you need something? It's not a big deal, but I want to thank you for the information about Anamnesis. As your senior executor, Big Sis Kokoro wants to give you some advice. You seemed hesitant when killing that Revenant. If you keep that up, you'll get yourself killed. You don't need to tell me, I know. Revenants will always try to hit you where you're vulnerable. It didn't ask for help because it was in pain. It instinctively knew that you would hesitate. It was tricking me? Some of them are pretty cunning, so if you're gonna continue to fight Revenants, keep a strong heart. Don't lose sight of yourself, or else the Revenants will consume your soul. Most of them collect the souls of the dead and the living. There are some exceptions, but they all have a main goal. 
their goal. There's a reason you became an executor, right? Then good luck. Don't go giving in. Yeah. She didn't need to tell me that. But what is the goal of the Revenants? I'm okay. Thanks, Thalima. have been useless. far. something, so I'll change. I need to grow stronger. A book will ease my mind. Yeah. 
happened back then? Watch the Lima. I'll save Mirai. Good night. <laughs>